and needed some coins to build that dream team you guys have always wanted, make sure to head on over to my sponsor, Buy Madden Coins. They have the cheapest, the quickest, and most reliable coins on the market right now. Head on over to Buy Madden Coins and use code Poodle at checkout for 20% off your order. Hey, what's going on, everybody? It's Poodle back with another Madden Ultimate Team guys today. I know it's a little late. I know, but I was gone in Spain for the week, so I did not get to do it. I have my Team of the Year Fantasy Pack, as you guys can see, right over here in open, open Packs. We finally got it. So, I'm super hyped for this, guys. As you guys know, as me, who I don't spend a good amount of money in this game. I spend a very minimal amount. A little bit for entertainment for you guys, which I'll probably start upping as of next year, guys. Don't expect me to always be no money spent. But, this is exciting, right? There's a few players that I want to pick up. You guys have been trashing my team lately, which is okay. It's fine. You guys have been trashing my team, saying it's not great. I understand that. But the issue is for me, right? I'm not the biggest YouTuber yet, so I like to save my coins so I can at least do some things on video for you guys. See, I could use all my coins to have a, a god squad and clean out my bind and everything, but if I do all that, then I can't make cool vids for you guys. So that's kind of been like the dilemma I've had this year. I'm in a weird little area, but I'm working on it, guys. We do have our Team of the Year fans pack. Just finished the solos as of this morning. Super hype. Hopefully, you guys all pull up and show some support, guys. By the way, thank you so much. You guys went crazy yesterday. Our channel flew right back up to normality right after our day back. Super hype. You guys are the best. Like, truthfully, I was in awe yesterday. I was in shock. Thank you guys for that. Now, let's keep it up. If you guys are new to this channel, you're here first time watching the vid. Make sure to subscribe to the channel. Come join the family. 20k by the end of February. Mark it down. That is our goal. That's our that's our date. It's our goal. And guys, can we get 500 likes in this video? I said, can we get 300 likes just in a video? You guys killed it on the flashback vid, like unbelievable. Can we get 500 likes in this team of the year fantasy video? And make sure to comment down below what you guys think I'm going to get. Right? Comment down below what you think I'm going to get. Now I'm going to tell you guys what I personally want. I'm going to go through. I love doing. I feel like there's always a fun way to do. It. I go through the team of the years. I'm going to go through the options of what I really don't want. It's very funny when I tell you guys what I don't want, and Madden's like, all right, you get three of them. So we're going to see right here as we go into team of the year. Let's start with the, are there 94, there's 94 to 95, so let's see here. So starting with these, Trust Way, I'm not going to lie, guys, I wouldn't be opposed to getting Trey Way. So like, here's the thing. I'll tell you guys who I want right now. Going through, I'll tell you guys, I absolutely will be pissed if I get now Trey Way. Like, guys, if it's the only option in the pack, like, I'll take him. Because I definitely, you can use a punter, right? Maybe, right? I'm, I'm, not, I'm not excited about it. Patrick Ricard. Again, another guy that I probably will take. I won't be mad. Like, if I get him, I'll be like, okay, I just want to get a guy that's not usable. That is the worst thing as a fantasy player pack. You know what I'm talking about? When you're playing for these fantasy packs, the worst thing you can get is a guy that you can't even use. So, I'll take Patrick Ricard. I won't be happy, but I won't be mad. Now, Corey Littleton. I will be pissed off. I will be pissed off if you have, I have to end up taking him. But there's three options, so you know there's still hope. Corey Littleton, not better than Shazier, not better than Devin Bush for me. He's too slow. I need a user. Not my thing. Now there's Zane Gonzalez. Again, won't be opposed. 97 kick power. Are you kidding me, guys? Honestly, I'll be pretty hyped by getting Zane. If he's my only option, I will take him. That is a massive upgrade. I could probably nail like 60 yarders. Gonna really help me out offensively. Everson Griffin, won't be too happy about. It. I'm getting Aaron Donald. He's currently slightly better than my current Aaron Donald. Not going to be a big fan if I get this card. Definitely would prefer. If I got him, though, I don't know. Do I power him up? Is there, like, an exchange that I could do? We got to figure all that out. Tariq Cohen, I'll be pissed off. Be pissed off. There's no use for him. So, so far, the no-nos are Zane Gonzalez and Corey Littleton out of the 95s, which is good. That's actually very good because that means that it's very unlikely that I end up unhappy out of this pack. Jonathan Jones. I won't be happy, but he's not horrible. 96 speed, not not a horrible, honestly. Geno Atkins, again, not a guy that I'll be pissed about because I do need a defensive tackle. My defensive tackle game has been uber weak this year. Like, I have not upgraded at all. Geno Atkins, like, I'll take him. I won't be mad. McCole Harbin, again, not going to be mad about because he does have a 97 speed. I'll throw him in at returning. I'll throw him as a returner. Kind of annoying, though, but I'll probably toss him in even as a, as a main receiver with that speed. Going to be pretty useful. Toss him in. If I can, if, can you put Shaker on them? I don't, I don't think you can. If I could have, would have been pretty awesome. Now, 96, 97. This is where things get good. All right, so Casey Hayward Jr., pissed. If I get him, pissed. Can't be used. Can't be used in my team. Denzel Ward's faster than him. Now, again, it's not always just about speed, but right now, it kind of is. I don't want him at all. Will not be happy if I get him. Joel Batonio, super excited. Like, I, I don't want him, but I'll take him. Now, his pass block is phenomenal, and I definitely need an upgrade to left guard. So, as long as, you know, linemen are my safety valves. I see linemen as a safety valve. If I get a lineman, it is what it is, right? It, it is what it is because I definitely need the upgrade. It's a guy you don't want to buy anyways. So, then I'll use my coins to buy like an Aaron Donald, right? I'll be more excited about it. It's Darius Smith. You know, I can't say pissed off because I still use Von Miller. So, honestly, probably wouldn't be too horrible. Probably he's a solid pass rusher. Does he have a zone? Does he have a zone? That That is the key here. Something tells me he does not. 61 zone yeah i didn't think so he'll be decent i would i wouldn't be happy but i wouldn't be pissed again calais campbell another guy where won't be too excited about 
because I have Michael Strand, so definitely not one of the ones that I want. But again, I'll worry about that later. Nick Chubb, pissed. I'll be pissed if I get Nick Chubb. I have Bo Jackson, no use for him. Grady Jarrett, defensive tackle, again, be fine. Michael Thomas, I'll be pissed. I'll be pissed if I get Michael Thomas. He's way too slow, can't use him. Chris Godwin, though, a little bit better. A little bit better, but you can't power him up. So again, same thing. Chandler Jones. You know what's sad? I think I'm happier with more of the 95s and the 96s. Chandler Jones won't, won't care for. Luke Keekley. I wouldn't be mad because again, I'll just end up, I'll actually end up powering up Luke Keekley and then power up to his uh, his career tribute and end up with like a 99 middle linebacker. So I won't be pissed, but definitely on my options. Zach Martin, solid right guard, no problem. Ryan Jensen, solid center. Braden Smith, solid tackle. All the linemen I have no problem with. And then Minka Fitzpatrick, I won't be excited about because I have uh, Sean Taylor. So definitely do not want Minka Fitzpatrick. DeAndre Hopkins, I'd probably end up, I'd be okay with. I'll just power him up all the way, although he's a little slow, but I do have him powered up already, so it wouldn't be horrible. And then as obviously the two guys that I really, really want are either, I want George Kittle or Aaron Donald. George Kittle, Aaron Donald. Quite honestly, if I got Jamal Adams, he's awesome, but I can't use him over Tillman. Tillman's free, I'd much rather not have him. But if I can get Kittle, if I can get Donald, or I can get Wilson, I'll be excited. Now, Russell Wilson, I don't know what I'd actually do if I'd power him up, because Lamar Jackson comes out in probably about two weeks with his MVP card. I'm not entirely sure. So let's get over to this pack. Let's see what we're working with, and let's see how this is gonna affect the team. Super excited. EA, please do not screw me. I've done you guys right all year. I promote this game as a content creator. I help you guys out. Help me out here. Let's open up this pack. I don't know if it starts with defense, offense, or specialist. Let's see. So first one, I don't know the animations, so I can't tell you what this is, but it looks out. Russell Wilson. Okay. We got Russell Wilson. You know, again, I don't entirely need a quarterback, but you can't be mad about getting one of the 97s, right? You can't be mad about that. Solid card. Now, that means I definitely will sell Vic. I definitely will be selling Vic, and I'll definitely be using Wilson for the time being. I'll rock with him for now, if need be. Definitely good op. Okay, let's start. From, let's hit it from the back. I believe that's a specialist. Okay, another solid. Give me Zane Gonzalez. Geno Atkins. So, okay, is that defense or is that special? That's a specialist. Okay, perfect. Give me Aaron Donald. Give me Aaron Donald, please. God, Casey Hayward Jr. Ah, okay, so that's a no. Geno Atkins is obviously, I think it has to be a no, right? Russell Wilson's definitely on the move. Russell Wilson's solid. See, I would have preferred a defensive player because I would have been able to put him anywhere on my team. I would have been able to slot him in for the rest of the year. Russell Wilson's not an end game card, in my opinion, for my team personally. So this is a dilemma, right? Do I take Russell Wilson or do I take Geno Adkins? This is a tough one. I think, I mean, it's not tough. Like, you have to take Russell Wilson, right? 97 overall. Gonna get me a lot more training if I have to get rid of him. Definitely, you gotta take a 97, right? Geno Atkins definitely not worth the defensive tackle, even though he's gonna be there for the rest of the year for me. Guys, comment down below who you guys think I should take. This might sound stupid, right? But Russell Wilson, I have Lamar. I want Lamar on my team the rest of the year. I don't know if I want Russell Wilson. So Lamar comes out in about a week and a half, two weeks, right? Right before the Super Bowl. And then we might even get an MVP Mahomes. So let me know what you guys think. I'm gonna have to look into training values and everything, see what I think is better here as a whole if I have to sell them. But let me know what you guys think. I'm thinking Russell Wilson, but again, Geno Atkins, I can put on my team all year. He's done. He could be at least my defensive tackle too. He'll be my defensive tackle one for now, and he could eventually be my two. So that's not entirely bad. I, I mean, we technically pulled the best one, right? We pulled one of the two best. It's him, him or Aaron Donald. So I'm super hyped. Now it just depends, right? Okay, you guys gotta help me out with this one. Russell Wilson looks solid. He has only he will have a 99 throw on the run of my team. He'll have a great accuracy, like 99 deep accuracy, really good throw power. Going to be one of the best quarterbacks in Madden right now. Probably the best quarterback in Madden right now. So maybe I might have to go test out some weekend league with this guy now. I don't know. Comment down below, Russell Wilson versus Geno Atkins. Let me know what you guys think down below. Let me go check out their prices real quick to see what we're really working with here. I'm pretty sure Russell Wilson's like the best one. And what are their training values? I mean, that's interesting, right? So 12,000 was the half. I mean, I don't know if they quick sell for full. You guys gotta let me know this all down below. Let's go to 96, 97s. Let's go check out Russell Wilson. I mean, price-wise, Wilson's a move, right? Price-wise, we just got, yeah, like almost a, a 400, what, 480K quarterback? Price-wise, he's the move, so Vic's gotta go. Vic's gotta go no matter what, either way. Maybe I'll, maybe I'll rock with Wilson for now, have some fun with him, and then see what I end up doing with him. Maybe I end up quick-selling him. If, I mean, there's no, there's no exchange for these, right? That'd be super cool if they had an exchange. Can you re-roll them for a full team of the year? Is that a thing? Oh. Okay. See, now this is interesting. This is real, guys, this is intriguing. So Wilson probably sells for what? Like, I'd imagine, well, like 45,000 trading. I don't, I don't even know. But I could re-roll again here and get a 96 plus 
but only one. So that's scary, because I could get something I don't want. Now, team of the year pack. Hmm. Interesting. All right, guys, that is better for the video. Comment down. I need some help here. Comment down below. First off, Wilson versus Gino Atkins. I'm thinking Wilson now with all the, tra the training I can do here. The Nat Team of the Year player pack is definitely solid, but I could get a lot of things I don't want, which then in turn mean that I will be losing a lot of training. So this is very hard. This is going to be a very hard decision. Let me know down below what you guys think. Comment down below Wilson or Gino Atkins. I'm thinking Wilson now. But guys, that's about it for the video. Thank you guys so much for watching. Stay tuned. I don't know when this video will be going up sometime today. Thank you guys so much for watching. If you're new to the channel, hit that subscribe button. Turn on the Naughty Bell Boys. Let's get to our goal of 20k as soon as possible. Make sure to smash the like button. Can we get 500 likes on this video for pulling one of the best team of the year cards available? And make sure to comment down below and help me out down below in the comments. I'll be reading all of them. I'll be responding to all you guys who helped me. Thank you guys. I'm out. Peace.